rend les choses faciles. Et sèche-moi ces larmes de crocodile. So from the green one, I've got some Dawn dish soap. Purple one's just water. I'm gonna go ahead and clean the bottom of the OEM side skirt. That way, this 3M tape won't stick a little better. Oh, I did not put the car up. I gotta still do that. Um, OEM clips. Or, what are these guys? Yeah, these little guys, so the way these work, these are a little different from the tray on the uh, engine bay. So you take this out first and then you remove this little grommet clip and uh, they'll come out. There are about, what, uh, five or six of those and then in the front we've got a screw with a washer. I can't remember if that's OEM or not, but that's what I had, and I'm gonna have to take the, uh, raise the car up, get it off the jacks, and then put um, put the car on my uh, ramps because this jack is gonna get in the way. Hopefully, that's not gonna be a pain in the butt later with the kit, as I need to jack the car up. But if it is then I'll probably end up cutting the, the Maxton side skirt because having my car on jack stands is a normal thing. Okay guys, so I went ahead and put a bunch of uh, 3M tape on this side. It, this seems to work really well and hold it in place very good. I did use uh, 10 tapping screws or self tapping screws that came with the kit as well. And I had to go to the hardware store and pick up this weird little plastic bit um, because the stock ones were no longer reaching the hole so here's the part number for them and there we go and I did have to drill the holes in this kit I think the drill bit was 9 16 so that one's really seemed to work um, this little whatever this insulating body clip is uh, works really well I've only had to use three of them, but I'll probably look online or Amazon, see if I can find this part number and uh, pick up like two more, two more. Yeah, that should do. Unfortunately, I forgot to film footage for the driver's side. This is the passenger side. I found it easier to use the push clip in the middle of the side skirt, get that in place um, and then work from the middle out. The 3M tape was really tacky, so be careful not to push that on there too hard or else you'll have to kind of take it back off and uh, resituate the lip. But if you just do that, you put the push clips in place, um, work them from center outward, and then push the 3M tape on there firmly, and then go ahead and use your self-tapping screws that came with the kit. I think you use 10 of those on each side. I went ahead and used those. It might have been a little overkill with the 3M tape, self-tapping screws, and the extra clips that I bought, but I'd rather have this thing stay in place for a long time versus having to redo something or the lip coming loose. As far as I can tell right now, it's really sturdy, and it doesn't seem like it's going to go anywhere at all. Okay. Lastly, for the rear spats, um, I use this 3M tape all the way down. It'd be better if you didn't leave any gaps. Um, that way, this back part, uh, the rear that goes around to the exhaust, wouldn't catch any rocks. So, but uh, I've gone ahead and taped it like this. I just cut the rest of this 3M in half, put two strips here, and drilled the holes. Uh, the holes are a little, 
it's hard to get in the rear just because there's not room back there but the way you do it is you use the washer the locking nut and then the bolt you get four of these for each side of the rear and eight total so go ahead and put this onto the car and it'll be all done full body kit from Maxton it's been uh, interesting to see you know uh, for the installation of the kit because it is kind of uh, just uh, doesn't have really have everything but it's pretty close to everything um, this 3M tape is really doing a great job though uh, you can pick this up at Amazon I think this is just an inch and a half or sorry an inch or you can just get it at AutoZone that's where I ended up getting mine and I would suggest buying two rolls of where is it yeah here it is so here's the yeah one roll it's what 15 feet and like one package of this is eight uh, sixteen dollars seventeen dollars but I would highly suggest grabbing two of these so you don't have to run out and get one in the middle of the job but yeah I'll go ahead and get this rear on Okay, dudes, Maxon kit is all installed, ready to rock. Ready to rock. <laughs> anyway, install overall wasn't too terrible. Boom, look at that. Rear came out pretty good. Oh, yeah, looks good. So, there it is. I'll definitely uh, make a point to get you guys some glamour shots. A little later if not the thumbnail so there it is looks good came out pretty good pretty happy with it everything's pretty uh, pretty stable so far but uh, man that gloss is gonna look really good once the car is clean and yeah it looks good so all right thanks for watching guys see ya